kick with me, Adirami. I'm an artist and, well, visual artist. And you're now watching Alter Daily. Okay, I'm actually an abstract textile artist. So I do a lot of fabric work. Um, basically, a lot of stitching, dyeing, different things. Mostly just play around and experiment and hope for the best, really. My course was textiles, innovation and design. Uh... I specialized in like printing techniques, but different printing techniques. So a bunch of Loughborough <laughs> University. Yeah. I've always kind of been into that kind of thing. I really wasn't fond of like school, things like that. I just spent most of my time drawing and creating and I find it like exciting and you don't really know what you're going to get at the end, but you're just doing things. It evolved from you know 2d pencil to kind of seeing what i could create and how far i could go and like how much texture you can add to something and things like that um and i used to do pretty like figurative stuff and then it all just kind of shifted into this abstract realm i don't know it's not like a moment of realization that i loved it it was always kind of like an outlet for me so something that was just always consistently there and then i just figured out of everything i'm doing this is what i enjoy the most yeah i was on instagram and i saw these you know really nice looking bodies and i was feeling real down on myself like you a little chubby fat ass kind of thing so it was just the idea was kind of to draw women your everyday woman not you know and um post it and encourage more women to submit images and post it so basically at the beginning it was friends and family people close to me that were sending me stuff and then by the end it's like random women i will never meet just yeah on instagram they'd be like oh they really like it i don't keep them i thought that'd be weird like once i've drawn it i don't keep it it's not really it's not appropriate well the thing is a lot of people wanted their own nudes on shirts i was just pleased that people you know actually sent stuff in bought into the idea like found it empowering and things like that so that's really the aim and it's like you know see your body as art as opposed to something you have to kind of like oh you're constantly judging and comparing to other people because that's not what it should be Oh, I've drawn myself a few times. There were like a few, you know, dry weeks where there's no pictures. So I just, you know, snap something up, dry it. But no, you'll no, never no. know. So they all start off as pencil drawings, like pencil on paper drawings. And then depending on the color t-shirt you want, I'll like um, adapt it on Photoshop. So the brighter colors, they can just be like your straight up pencil drawing. You just remove the background and... I send it to the printers but then the black ones you kind of have to like invert the colors and everything make it like digitally kind of shade areas so that it'll pop and actually come out as something you can see mm, i don't really know that i have a favorite piece like for me most of my work is kind of the process that's important and then once it's done it's just something to kind of like give to the world but like my work is quite a sort of cathartic relaxing process for me and then once it's done i don't really have anything i like more than anything else because it's all served its purpose for me being my own boss is hard because you have to like fully self-motivate and you have to do all this stuff that like if you're in the office there's somebody telling you you have this deadline you have that deadline but if it's you you just have to get up and do it and make yourself do it and then I don't know. There's like the side of things I don't enjoy, which is the marketing, trying to get my sh out there, trying to like, you know, find people to buy into the work and things like that. I hate it, but then obviously it doesn't really make money. So it's difficult, but then I guess you just have to persevere. I'm so much on the fringes that I don't really, I don't really know. Um... I think it could be easier to break into if I was sort of less shy, <laughs> but I'm really shy. I find it hard putting myself out there and, you know, 
you're sort of meant to network and things like that but i just feel like it's forcing yourself on people i don't do well in situations like that but i'm trying and um i don't think it's so hard because people are quite nice here i'm quite supportive of what you're doing and everything like that thanks for having me what do i say this is Alter daily this is Alter daily <laughs> The Alternative Network.